I will never leave this house without you. Never. Oh, I know. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There's one of Julian's goons trying to sneak in. Oh, no, no. But I won't cut them. I will fight them to the finish. Come here. somebody gets hurt. Reason with me about what? I am not leaving this house without my baby. Teresa, I get where you're coming from with Julian, okay? But, but, but he is insisting that Crane's security knock down that door. And I would hate to see little Ethan get hurt by wood shards flying all over the place or something. Oh, God, you're right. You're right. that this is happening. All I wanted to be was Mrs. Crane. Mrs. Ethan Crane, and then I wound up being Mrs. Julian Crane in that dishonor. It cost me you. Teresa. The one person I love most in this world. Teresa, honey, you need to focus on here and now, okay? But I am. Little Ethan is the only good thing that has come out of this mess, and now Julian wants to take it from me. Well, I won't let him. I won't let that evil man touch my baby. I don't blame you. That's why I'm here. Help you any way I can. What about our baby? What about our future? Ethan, please do right by us and open the door. Help me. Ethan, I am begging you. Uh, Teresa, Teresa Gwen is right. Right, you know I care about little Ethan, but I... I've got to put my wife and our child through. No, no, please. Teresa, look, I'm, I'm more than happy to help you legally, but what do you really hope to gain by keeping the baby locked up in here? I mean, uh, what about food for him? <laughs> Julian, he won't let a great hair starve. No, maybe not, but you just can't keep a child holed up in here either. That's not right. Teresa, be reasonable. You need to stop this now. I can't. Julian has left me no choice. You can choose to leave. You can choose to fight him another day. I'll help you any way I can, but you have to be reasonable. Teresa, you need to open the door now. Teresa, the whole family's here. We're not gonna let Julian take your baby away. I'm safe, Ethan. 